doing something a little bit different today we are doing a day in the life as ex jehovah's witnesses okay yeah this has been a little request we got so yes. shoot a little saturday routine for one tell me what we ain't doing today <laughs> we're not going out <laughs> of service and we're not going to the meetings yeah, okay get all that we ain't have to do that in a long time and this is the freedom you get you get to wake up and just do what you feel like doing so unlike you jehovah's witnesses that can't follow rules and stuff you are allowed to say it. <laughs> it's just an herb, okay? Yeah, it ain't nothing but an herb. Literally. So we Rules like to sage right. and to get our day started that way. We're going to head over to the gym. It is 8.50 in the morning. We're trying to get there before the crowd sweeps in. Yeah, we got like a smooth hour before then. So we're going to get in and out. But kind of let y'all know what we do during the day or at least on our free days. Yeah. Yep. And so this is the cleanse. <laughs> All the bad energy. Yeah, all the okay? bad energy is going to be in the comments. <laughs> this to a good Saturday. Cheers to a good Saturday. I say. I say. We take honey and salt as our pre workout so we don't get the um the jitters. So, life hack to y'all. Yeah, we get the natural jitters. <laughs> all right. Oh, I got the honey leaking. <laughs> okay, there we go. Right, we made it back from the gym on the early morning side right we are back home and we were just sitting here thinking about like the difference of our lives now versus whenever we were jehovah's witnesses and to be honest there's not like a crazy massive difference in our day-to-day -day life for real honestly even i think we make our situation a little different we wouldn't we didn't go from like super witnessy to waking up like we already was on our way out yeah kind of doing what we wanted to do we won going to meetings like that our last year or two yeah and service well it was that. covid so like we were on the zoom meetings and right stuff, and i do not like the zoom meetings i used to have my camera turned off for real so it's kind of like our life is pretty much what we've been wanting to do we just wake up ain't got to go on service no stuff like that go to the gym yeah. go to the store do your running around and whatever activities we feel like doing yeah it used to be such a task to just like have to be up for the meetings and then service on Sundays. Like it was just always something you had to do. And boom, your first half of the morning was already gone. Like right yeah, now, it's a waste. It is. Yeah. Like right now, it's what ten a.m. Right. So we still have. At this time, we would be at the meeting. You know, not getting out until noon, yeah. and then people want to go out to eat. So like your whole day is like. Well, that'd be on Sunday. Yeah, or Saturday. Like, my yeah. meetings used to be Saturdays oh, or Sundays. Okay. Yeah. But same with service. It doesn't end until noon. Right. Too, so. Depending on who you with. Because some people push that stuff all day. Yeah. Like, my granddad, he, I'm talking about 2, 3 o'clock. Return <laughs> visits, all that. And then the next day, either you got service and then the meeting or the meeting and then service, however your weekend's with. So, yeah, your weekend is blown. We get to do whatever we want tomorrow morning, too. Yep, and today. So, I don't know what our plans are going to be yet for the rest of the day, but, you know, we're going to take you guys along. Yep. <laughs> all right, y'all. So, we just got dressed. We are going to head out. We're going to go to our favorite place. Yeah. Lowe's. Lowe's. <laughs> Because we're doing backyard work. We just got some trees cut. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. A tree fell on the back of our house. So it had been sitting there forever. And then he chopped it up into pieces. Yep. And we finally got, like, people to come in and, like, take out the rest of the dead trees that were back there. There was, like, three. Yeah, it was. Yeah. But thankfully, it landed. This is the funny part about that Jehovah's Holy Spirit stuff. <laughs> we supposed to be apostates. Yeah. This tree fell and landed just barely on the house. Like, it, like landed here no damage no damage no damage and it landed like literally it was right on the house it like was the so tips crazy. of the branches just was like mm, on the yeah. house yeah chopped it up got that gone they got the rest so listen we're yeah. protected okay <laughs> yeah come on i mean was that jehovah's holy spirit we supposed to be jehovah's enemies according to y'all right it should have yeah. taken our whole back of the house down so yeah, yeah we're gonna go do that probably get a plant because we love plants yeah. and i think people think that now that we're because we get this comment a lot like it just sounded like you guys just wanted to be worldly 
what even is worldly first of all we're literally go gonna go to lowe's get some plants we're not even like big clubbers every once in a while we'll go out but right we're not yeah, we're we not do the regular type. stuff only yeah. thing is we don't belong to somebody say so we don't have to report to a building yes. or have a group of men tell us what we can and can't do right so That's if we want to go to the club we will because have y'all yeah. going to the club anyway okay you you went out the club more when you were a witness than you did. Right. Come on. For real, that's facts. <laughs> it's true. Because yeah. it's like you're suppressing it. But no, we. Yeah. this is like a basic Saturday for us. Yeah, running around. Doing mm. what we want to do. Yeah. That's and it. we're going to get the bombish Jamaican food. We're, we're going to show you guys yeah. Jamaican food. If anybody lives in Atlanta, y'all need to hit this Jamaican food place up. So good. Yeah. So here we go. We might make some pit stops on the way. Y'all stay tuned. So we live right around the corner from a we are driving up into where we used to live it's so weird coming over here it feels like it's like deja vu right? though. Like oh, time travel. this was our first apartment in georgia the gym. i wonder if they fixed it up at all right we used to go to that gym we never drove back here though there was the fitness center that's where we used to go it's cute up here though we liked these apartments yeah, they was until cool. the end oh my gosh yeah, then they just got everything yes our microwave broke oh i hated these apartments at the beginning at the bottom yep this bottom coming out every day go to work come to home always like this is a cool starter apartment you yeah know, first it was. time here it was cool i liked it those little flowers are so pretty when they, you come up in here but there was a bar around the corner oh, we used to go bad. to that bar all the time and it was so worth it kroger was right across there it literally t used to take us what two minutes to get to everything because kroger's right there liquor store's here our bar was right around the corner. Yeah, yeah this was a close apartment. We couldn't wait to get out of it, but it was cool for the time being. It definitely was cool. It was just because we, we had to go to somewhere else to get our clothes washed. So that sucked. Right. And then um, everything started falling apart at the end. It was like, you could tell that they did the renovations, like just to patch up work, you know? Well, yeah, that's the aisle right here. You go straight from the right. And this is it, if y'all ain't had this one right here. So good. If y'all can find it. The best sangria you can get. Both of those. Have we tried both of them? Yeah, we didn't try them both. Ooh, that's something that we like about Atlanta in general, though, is that, like, everywhere that you go here, every pocket is different. Yeah. It's so, it's so nice. Like, there's, I don't know, a lot of culture down here. Yeah, like, everybody got their areas, like, certain areas, whatever. If you're from, you know, Haiti or something like that, wherever you're from, like, you can find a community somewhere. Yeah. Already. Like, so around where we live, there's a lot of Jamaicans, too. There's a lot of Jamaicans scattered through, um, through Atlanta. Through Atlanta, because yeah. there's a bunch of... We haven't tried a bad Jamaican restaurant yet, No, so. they've all been hits. Yeah, they've all been I'm so excited, because we're about to go to a Mexican restaurant that we used to go to all the time, and it was so good. Mexico Lindo. From one place to the next, and some of this stuff. Our first two stops was spur of the moment. That's the fun I know. Part. <laughs> spur of the moment stop. But those are like the best days whenever you just have, you know, you're just going with the vibe. Yeah. Oh, we just out and about. This one of the first weekends that's been like warm, not raining. Right. We that we're even able to be out and about. Springtime is my favorite because this is what we used to do. Like, and we like going on walks. Be stuck in the house cold for months so by the time that stuff over we're like you're ready to go do stuff i hibernate in the winter so yeah. we do not be trying to go out like we literally only go on indoor dates That's in the real. winter time because our whole plan was to get away from Sometimes you might get stuck. It's just, it ain't, it ain't the move. No, 
and there's black ice so you literally don't see the ice that's underneath the snow i hate it i'm a travel nurse so like i literally hated driving to work in the snow it was so bad yeah it, it would get like that i got snowed into the parking lot a few times i forgot about that even when you have to go home there's no telling if it's gonna be a smooth drive home like it might snow while you at work and then you're like man i gotta deal with this yeah it's yeah i mean some people like it like it's it, it's cool too like for the winter uh that winter season vibe and all that or if you're like a holiday person like it's it's like, cool for it's that cool time too. it's fun because we yeah. went back we went back to my home for christmas time so we were back in pittsburgh pennsylvania and my family like my mom and my sisters they celebrated this past year so that was fun like being there when it was cold but it didn't snow no. the one time i would have wanted it to snow it didn't right no. there we used to go there it's a mexican hispanic grocery store the supermercado there's a lot of spanish businesses down here which Yo, was so nice that's what's dope once you come to this this mableton area a lot of hispanic mexico lindo this is the guac we get from here it's all chunky and it's so good <laughs> gotta put those chips to the side right. oh how do you make it got a bar in it Yep. Got vegan enchiladas. Babe, what you got? Fajitas. Cake fajitas. Oh, yeah. This must be here. Hostel. We had never been down here, really. It's crazy because downtown Hostel looks like so old timey. Don't it? Yeah. I mean, it took a time travel somewhere. No, for real. It is not um, like updated at all downtown. Only on like the other sides. Ooh, so pretty. We need to get our outside together too. I like these. Oh, you mean like, like the front. Yeah, I like with those. Guys, we love those. <laughs> We're bringing home some plant babies. We have one of these already, but our one at home is like huge and gorgeous. And we're getting one of these. All right, y'all, we are finally back home. Babe, where are you? Say hey, babe. What's up with it? We <laughs> back at it. Got us hurt. I'm gonna show Chewy, hold on. Chewy, Chewy. <laughs> but here's one of our tropical plants. And then we have avocado tree right here. It's growing. Started this one from a little pit. And we had to get a new bamboo plant because our old bamboo we accidentally watered it two times in one week and it died on us. So we had to get a new one. And we got this plant to go upstairs. Here's our front. This one's really sensitive. Tries to die all the time. And then we got this one today. It's just like this plant that we have. This one's just gotten really big. And so we wanted one to match it. But yeah. We're just going to be hanging out. That wraps it up for the day for the most part. Yeah, honestly, we're about to just sit here and chill, probably watch a movie. We ended up not going to that Atlanta station place, but sorry, yeah. we had a bunch of yeah. random stuff that we did. Today, it started so. early at that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so we're going to sit here. We're going to hang out. He's going to play his PS5. I'm going to play my that phone games. <laughs> <laughs> yep. We're going to be on chill mode for the rest of the night. Most yep. likely. Probably shoot some content. So y'all see this coming soon and yes. another video on top of that. Yes, that's right. I don't know what we're going to shoot tonight. At. So we'll see right. on the next we job. We have a list of topics. <laughs> right. But yeah, thank y'all for watching and shoot. We'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Peace.